In this video, I'm going to talk about multiple different things, and you guys are going to want to stay tuned into this video. So basically, we're going to talk about the ego, popularity, respect, certain things like this. It's an important con it's a it's an important conversation to have, um, because I feel a lot of people mess up a lot in life, and they don't do what they should be doing and they learn too late of what they should have been doing all along and I don't know what it is I felt blessed from a young age to make the right moves and when you do make the right moves you are going to encounter a lot of difficulties if you're not facing difficulties you should be worried and I felt these difficulties ever since around the age of 18-19 making big changes, doing things, and um, people around my age group and even older not understanding it. So, I just want to talk, and this all has to do with what I'm about to get into. When we talk about popularity, it really does not exist. Being popular means you are well liked by a lot of people. It means you are well liked by a certain group of people. Basically it means you're liked by people that you want them to like you. You do things so they will like you. You act and behave in a way because you want to fit into a certain group or a certain crowd and you want to be accepted by these people, you want to get in with these people because you might think they're cool, you want to be cool just like them. It is not the right way of life, it is not the right way to do it, and when you were in your days of like high school or something like this, you could get caught up into that trap. It happens to most people. Um, I wasn't necessarily one of those people through and through, although some of it was like that, like the way that I was, I was I was a guy, I was playing sports and stuff like that. Um, I was well liked. I was never all in on being popular though, so I wasn't like one of those types of people, but I was just like a well liked person all in all. Kept to myself. Um, wasn't very competitive. I was, but I wasn't. I hid some of it. Because you know how it is, you don't you don't want to be hated, you want to be a well-liked person. But it's honestly a mistake and you're going to hold yourself back by having this type of a mindset. Instead of aiming to be popular, instead of aiming, and this is what I'm getting to, instead of aiming to be well-liked in these things, instead, aim to be well-respected. You can be respected but not liked. You can be liked and not respected. These are two different things. Um, I think every day of the week you should aim to be respected. And if you are being respected, you're obviously doing something right. And if you're being respected, I can almost guarantee you, you're going to have haters because not everybody is being respected. Everybody wants to be respected, but not everybody is respected. It all has to do with how well put together of a person you are and things of this nature and what you do with your life and your decisions and things like this. Um, <clears throat> you don't want to be that popular person. Trust me, you don't. I, I started falling out of this trap when I was 18, 19, like I said, and I lost a lot of things temporarily. And I started to develop haters. I started to develop respect from the right people. That's what you want. You want to be respected. Even your haters respect you. They're not always going to tell you or show it, but they do. And they might not like you too, but they respect you. Like I said, I would rather be respected than well liked. If people just like you, they like you because of what you're doing for them, honestly. And that's all right in some cases. But don't be that pushover type of person that's just acting and behaving in a way to make everybody else like them 
I know people like this and it's not healthy to be that way. You can be well liked and well respected. Aim for both. That's that's what you want. You don't want to be hated either. Um, if I had a decision, I don't want to be hated by anybody. I don't think anybody necessarily wants to be hated. But it's going to happen if you are a person, if you are a well put together person, you have success in whatever areas, whatever it might be, um, you're going to be highly respected by the realest people and also your haters, but your haters are not always going to like you for this because that's going to cause them to be jealous, insecure themselves because they're not on your level and they know they're not on your level and they want what you have but they don't know exactly how to get it. And that's because these individuals are too stuck in the past. They're too stuck in this high school type of mentality. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you guys, there's people in their 30s that is stuck in this high school mentality of wanting to be liked by everybody and being popular. It doesn't even necessarily mean you're 20 years old, 21, 22, 23, and you're still like this. Guys, there's people that are fucking 30 that are still like this and a lot of a lot of these types of people learn way too late I learned this stuff when I was like 18 19 as soon as I was coming out of my high school days and even coming on to the end of high school I was calling people fake to their face just because I seen people's true intentions and I always had a gift to be able to see this stuff and I knew it was a trap I knew this shit is, it's trash, it's garbage. Who cares about being popular? Uh, who cares about stuff like this? Cause it always comes to an end. It never lasts, it's not even real. Like it's all egotistical types of behavior. All the people that act and behave in this way. There's even celebrities that are doing this guys. It's all egotistical behavior. It's not genuine. It's not real. People try to do this because they want to fit in. They want to hang around with certain people. They want to be with certain people. So they act and behave in a way that allows them to fit in. Don't ever fall into this trap. You want to diminish your own ego so this doesn't happen and you want to become real. You want to become yourself. And you're, if you do this, you are going to lose people. People might stop liking you. And that's all right. Not everybody is supposed to like you. If you're actually being yourself and you're being real and genuine, not everybody is going to like you. Let me tell you that now. But depending on who you are and what you do, you will be respected even by the people that don't like you. Like I said, um, depending on what you do and who you are as a person, who you become, there's going to be respect there. Trust me. People are not necessarily stupid. People know who you who you are and what you're doing and where you're going. And they might not like you for it, but they're going to respect it deep down inside. They know. Deep down. And sometimes these are the most egotistical people that just don't never want to give you your credit. They'll do everything but give you your credit. Especially if you're skyrocketing past where they are. And they know they have egos. They know they're living in this high school type of mentality of wanting to be liked, wanting to be popular, wanting to fit in, not wanting to go off on their own path and stuff like this. They would rather live that comfortable, I want everybody to like me type of life where they're fitting in and it is a trap. The older you get and the more you are still like this, the worse it gets. If you can cut this bullshit behavior off, at a young age and start doing you start being your best self start showing your best work stop caring if people are going to get jealous of you that's what stops a lot of people from doing what they want to do because they know what they do is probably good and they don't want to put it out there because they don't want to they don't want to make people jealous they don't want to come off as a person that has fooled themselves even though it is not like that you're just being yourself you're just doing your work, but they don't want to make anybody mad. God forbid. They don't want to make anybody uncomfortable, so they don't put their best stuff out there. They're not being their best self. They're staying down with everybody else.
that's something I never did. That's something I never gave a shit about. And I respect people that have that same type of a mindset. And it's not like I don't respect other people either. I respect everybody in a certain sense, but I just wish these people would understand how this really is too. And that you are wasting your time. You are wasting your life. These people are not going to be around. These people are going to get into relationships and all that stuff comes to an end and they go off and they live their own life and you're going to realize that it was actually just you all along and none of this shit mattered. Fitting in does not matter. All these people that are fitting in are actually the most lost in their life and that is the truth and they're not going to know it until they know it and the sooner you realize that the better life gets. So that's just the truth guys and this is exactly why you have to diminish and I mean you have to diminish your own ego to save yourself. That's what you gotta do. I'm cutting this video off now. I got another one to do and I'll probably do a third tonight as well on astrology. So I'll be back.